Hello and welcome. I'm Anthony Hudson. It's great to have you with us at Marvel Stadium. We're looking forward to a pre-season match today between Essendon and Sydney. Preparations for round one are in full swing. Both sides will be determined to take confidence and momentum into the Premiership season. Now it's time for the players to take to the field. Joins me. Who's your pick today, Half? Huh? Thanks, Hutto. It's hard to pick a winner. There's very little to choose between these sides. Both have their flaws, which have been spoken about, but whoever can get on top in the clearances will have a big advantage. Okay, then. Thanks, Half. Time for some last minute instructions as the captains meet in the middle. There were some interesting things said during the week, but now it's time for actions. Draper wins the first hit out. Good ruck work and good roving too. Blakey read that well. What's he got on offer? McInerney at half back. Searching kick. Mills normally delivers. McGrath with a big fist. Merritt, the Swans, guarding the corridor. Martin crosses the paint. Oh, my word! Up, up and away! Might be just out of range. Has he got enough on it? Hamlin is there to save the day. Towards the boundary line. The kick is precise. Probing ball. Honours the lead. Doesn't often waste it. No one can mark. Caldwell needs a good decision. That might attract a pack. Langford, great hands there. The defence is disorganised. Grundy is there in defence. Quality delivery by foot. A chance to clear now. McInerney. His field kicking is normally first rate. Blakey kicks to half forward. Turned over on centre wing. The Swans have denied them the corridor. No one can mark. Hamling, clever kick. He's normally better than that. Can he find a teammate? Merritt. That's skillful. Stringer might be just outside his range. Picking their way through. Martin in the clear and marks uncontested. Sometimes taking these half chances can make all the difference. Is that the first goal of the match? No. Easy to say in hindsight, but that ball probably should have been centred. Blakey brings it back in. Cunningham has found some space. Have they weathered the storm? Bit of a nothing kick. McInerney, that's a quality hand pass. Goulden, they're building something dangerous here. Drives it inside the forward 50. Merritt, Draper. The Bombers showing some good signs early. Rampy takes an excellent grab. He doesn't waste many. Parker, Campbell, he's made a hot start to this match. Warner, they've got time to put the kettle on. Thumped away. Parrish, that's sloppy play. McDonald for the game's first goal. It's flirting with the post. It gives everyone a shot of confidence when one of your key forwards is able to hit the scoreboard early. The Swans have opened their account. Draper with a deft tap. Parrish. Gresham, he put himself in the line of fire. Dersma 
Fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. Hobbs, desperate defence. He couldn't get rid of it. They wanted holding the ball, but nothing doing. Draper slaps it out. Dersma cops some unwanted attention. It's there! It might just be in for a big day. Both sides are cracking in hard at the present time. It's a great contest. The big men fly. Goulden, he's suddenly a popular man. Dersma, desperate to win it back. Lloyd, he's gone. Terrific forward pressure, and we will do it all again. Rucks go at it. Dersma, he's wrapped up. Corbwell runs in and bangs it home. A real opportunist goal there. He doesn't need a lot of the footy to make an impact. The Bombers conceded the first, but they've been on top since then. The two big men do battle. Parrish. Corbwell. Knew the tackle was coming. Has he got enough on it? It's dropped short, but it matters not. They've hit the ground running and a goal here will give them a handy break. It's there! They keep moving the ball quickly. There'll be plenty more where that came from. The Swans have been slow out of the blocks. Good ruck work. Dersma, Parrish. He's besieged. Martin, Draper. They're playing with purpose and poise. Caddy takes the mark and can extend the margin. To say there are some alarm bells ringing is an understatement. They're not working hard enough. How's the kick? Nothing wrong with that. It's too early to panic, but they might think about making a couple of changes before a bad start becomes worse. The Swans need more from their key players. Draper wins it out of the centre. Dersma, it's a hot footy. Not sure who that was meant for, but it's been picked off. Bombs it in. Punched away. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Grundy with a chance to send it forward. Warner, Haywood, can he be the fire starter? McLean got to the right position and hung on. This is what he gets paid to do, kick these goals. Looking to pull one back, and that's exactly what he's done. Well played. They've looked to the likely source to provide a spark, and he's done just that. They've broken the run of goals at the other end, but they need a run of their own now. Goulden, Parker, punched away. Papley, he's so good in close. It's a tough game. Mackay takes the responsibility, just needs to finish. Finish he does. It's a gift, really, and he's taken full advantage. It's only early, I know, but that was a much-needed goal to establish a foothold in this match. Hobbs, he's under close attention. Martin, punched away. McCartan gets his kick despite the heat. No one can mark. Gathers it cleanly on the wing. Martin, feeling the heat. Their appeals have fallen on deaf ears. Draper got his palm to it. Adams, Papley. Heads towards half forward. Grundy, marks. Will he go the bomb? There goes the kick inside the 50. He's hit up the lead. This to get the margin back to just one point. To cap off a wonderful passage of play, that would have been a great team goal. Those are the kinds of opportunities you really need to take. Redmond heads wide with the kick in. Heppel, that's good work rate. Ridley works hard to present. The Bombers look sharp early. Warner wins it back. Great mark. Ignoring the corridor for now. Goulden, the Swans, can build something here. Papley has it at half forward. Warner. The kick was ill-directed. Closed him down. 
Gary Lyon is here. Gaz, what are your thoughts on what we've seen so far? Both coaches would be concerned about how easily the opposition midfielders are moving the footy at times. Merritt, Parker, Heppel saves the day. Can he hit a target? Good thinking and good execution too. He might have thought about the corridor. Redmond with a chance to run. It's a high ball. Parker making his claim for the Golden Fist Award. The Bombers are certainly looking the better side, but they love to give themselves a bit more breathing space here. Draper wins it down. Dersma, the midfield battle so important. Merritt, Hobbs, he's been busy so far. Caddy is like a magnet in that forward line. Normally a reliable kick. Can he make this one count? Looks good. He's steered it through. The Bombers have had a great start. Their energy is terrific. They're moving the ball well and hitting the scoreboard. Eight goals between the sides. It's been free-flowing footy. Parker, they'll need to limit his influence. McLean at centre-half forward. Papley running in support. Heaney, strong grab. This is an opportunity to settle some anxieties and get their teeth into the contest. Drop pass. It doesn't matter who you are, it's always good to get an early one on the ball. Nine goals for the quarter all up. It's been great to watch. Draper gets his hand to it. Hobbs, crunching tackle. This is promising. Langford is the target, and he marks. Can he deliver? Yeah, back him more often than not. Looks good off the boot. He's got it. That's a classy finish. We've become accustomed to that from him. Two goal game again. Draper got his palm to it. Hobbs, Merritt, dishes it off. Rampy gets in the way. Parker, sweeping handball. Well played. His vision was excellent. No one can mark. Papley, an ever present threat. From the pocket, looks good, is good. Better ball movement on that occasion allowed them to open up that opportunity in front of goal, and they've got full reward for it. One kick game again. Draper showing his skills. He's stopped in his tracks. Drives it inside the forward 50. Warner, the Swans, under great pressure. No easy exit, Adams. Parker, this is a big opportunity. Grundy. He's generally a good kick. Blakey tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. Honors the lead. Delivers it inside 50. Punched away. McLean throws it on the boot. This might be going through. It is a real team lifter. Leave him alone at your peril. Great finish. Good match so far. Grundy wins the tap. He ran into a brick wall. That's poor play. Does well under pressure. Warner. Slick hands. Grundy. How will the umpire see this? No free kick. And they've got a stoppage in a dangerous position. Draper palms it down. Merritt, Parker leading from the front. Terrific tackle. Martin blasts away. Caldwell has a vice like grip. He's got one already. Will this be number two? Perkins will save his teammates' blushes. Kicking at his first. I feel better now they're in front and getting some reward on the scoreboard. So the underdog throwing down the gauntlet. You can see their belief growing. Grundy, the winner there. Parker read it well. That's almost worth a kick. Adams, he's so clean with the footy. Heaney had his name written all over it. Straight in front, should not miss. Pops it through and scores a level. 
Some excellent use of the body to win that mark and then a calm and accurate finish to top it off. Back to where we started, scores level. Grundy smashes it out of there. Goulden is a real pocket rocket. Mackay showing why he's such a good defender. And they're away. McGrath with a chance to relieve the pressure. Campbell spoils. He's run into trouble. They ask the question, but the umpire will have it. Grundy wins it. Parker. Campbell takes the hand pass. On the non-preferred, McGrath runs onto it. Thought his way through it. The kick was centimetre perfect. Can they find a late goal? Merritt drives it inside the forward 50. Goulden tries to spike it out of the danger zone for a boost just before the break. This is very close. Neither team is able to string golf together or generate any meaningful momentum. It's an engrossing battle. The Bombers were underdogs coming in, but they look anything but in the early going. Grundy gets his hand to it. Hobbs, Merritt working hard and being rewarded. Perkins, can he impose himself on the match? That's an impressive mark. This to make a good start, a very good one. Through it goes, and they extend the lead. The Swans are on the back foot. That was possibly a bit too easy. Quarter time and a chance for the coaches to address their players and maybe even tweak the game plan. Let's head down to Gary Lyon on the boundary. A close, high-scoring game. What more could you want? Some of the forwards are enjoying themselves and it always feels like the next goal isn't far away. Having said that, if either midfield can find a way to better protect their defenders, that'll go a long way towards winning the match. Thanks for those observations, Gary, as we get back underway. Good ruck work. Parker throws it on the boot. Papley, Goulden into the action again already. Amati can go back and shoot at goal. He'd kick this more often than not. Big chance here. They need it, but he's missed. He really should have capitalised on that, but not to be. Redmond to bring it back in. Quality delivery by foot. The aerialist will battle for this ball. Grundy takes an excellent grab. Who's at home? Mills demanded the footy and got it. Papley, no one's gone near him and he could make them pay. Going at his second. He'll back himself here. What can he do? He can kick an amazing goal. Some good ball movement there created that opportunity and a cool finish as well. Underway once more. The two big men do battle. Parrish. Caddy. He's wrapped up. They want ball, but they're not going to get it. Grundy with a deft tap. Mills. Goulden. He's everywhere at the moment. McLean. Campbell. Farms it out. He'd like that one again. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Can't afford to give it back in the corridor. Papley got to the right position and hung on. That's good vision. McLean will take some stopping. He's got it. This could turn into a big bag the way he's going. Four goals already. The Swans are really taking it to them today. Draper punches it out of the ruck. Dersma, he's plucked it and should have a shot. They've got them on the overlap. He's hit up the lead. Neither side's been able to establish any dominance so far. This is a good game of footy.
bangs it through. He had the opportunity to put them in front. That's exactly what he's done. Lovely finish. It's a good old-fashioned arm wrestle. The big men fly. Adams. The defenders will be nervous. McDonald. They've worked it well. He doesn't miss many, so you wouldn't think this would pose any problems. Drop punt looks good. He's got it. There's nothing like a contested mark in goal to boost your confidence. Wonderful play. The Swans in front now. Draper got his palm to it. Parrish closed him down. The umpire whistles for a ball up. Draper wins it. Merritt. Parrish. This is great pressure footy. He's lost it. How'd he get rid of that? Illegally says the up. Good looking kick. Warner. Delivers to centre half forward. Papley was committed to the contest. Rowbottom. That's close. He liked it off the boot. On the board with his first. That'll boost his confidence. The Swans attacking it right up to their more fancied opponents. Grundy wins it. Parker. They've given it back. Parrish. What can he do with it? The distance is the only problem. Lux of fortune. It'll be a goal anyway. His goal was so far, but this would be a great way to get on the score sheet. He's got it. It's always good for the confidence to see that first shot go straight to him. The goals are coming thick and fast. This is great to watch. Punch clear. Parrish. That's not a mark. Cox. Heads for full forward. Wright can go back and put them in front. He hasn't got his name on the goal scorers list yet. Here's a good chance. To give them the lead. He's done it. So important to get reward for effort. On that occasion, the finish matched the quality of the work upfield. The Bombers have been impressive so far. There could be an upset brewing. Draper had his measure today. Parrish, good tackle. Gets the kick away. That's well played. For a little breathing space. Goes Goldwood, and he's off target. That passage of play deserved a better finish. Loy heads wide with the kick in. Campbell with a chance to run. He's normally good on his non-preferred. Thumped away. Hobbs sends him inside 50 again. McCartan read it well. They'll bide their time. Rowbottom pushes into space and receives the footy. Cunningham, can they get something going? Campbell can keep it moving. Gresham affects the turnover. Good kick. Hobbs. Up and under. Langford has a bus like grip. I'll back him to drive this right through the high diddle diddle. Goes at goal, and that is an opportunity gone begging. Missed one he should have got, and let him off the hook. Loy with the footy. Hamlin has found some space. The Swans might be able to start something. Robot wins the contest hands down. It's a tough game. Adams, he'll feel that one. Good thinking and good execution too. Inside 50 with the kick. No wonder the forwards are frustrated. The Bombers have got out of jail. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. Redmond, that's an aggressive handball. Hobbs, 
looking to extend this margin. Rowbottom, Spoils, Parker, Campbell. Some indirect ball movement here. Grundy. They cannot keep him quiet. McInerney. Whatever he's suffering from, it's not leather poisoning. Haywood, Marks, will he go the bomb? They've picked their way through. Heaney drops into the hole and Marks. It's so important to be efficient in front of goal, especially when it's tight on the scoreboard. He hasn't kicked it very well. Punched away. Taking no chances there. Redmond with the footy. Martin marks in the back pocket. He's got an option in the centre square. Dersma gets to the front spot. What a game he's having. Parrish. Drives it inside the forward 50. Outbodies his opponent and took a ripper. He hasn't missed yet. Can he keep a clean sheet? Drop punt. That'll be a goal. Never in doubt. And that was reminiscent of Tony Plugger Lockett. The way he used his body. Then went back and put it straight through the middle. They've got their tails up now. Grundy wins it. Dersma. There goes the kick inside the 50. Adams knew the tackle was coming. The Swans not at their best so far. Rowbottom dangerous to leave on his own. McLean has marked in front of goal. For five goals, he's almost single-handedly keeping them in this contest. It's on the way. Good-looking kick. He's dodged it. He's kept them in it. Just a pity he hasn't had more support. It's an understatement to say they needed that one. Goldstein wins it out of the centre. Dersma, that's a bruising tackle. Parrish heads for the pocket. Punched away. Langford, he's already got one. Now he's got two. He managed to find some space in a dangerous position and made them pay for their loose checking. The Bombers with a steadying goal. Grundy wins it. Parker, he'll be sore in the morning. That's a bit of a waste. Was that a throw? Turns it over in the middle. Towards full forward. McDonald! Too big, too strong, too good. He's been striking them well. This shouldn't present any problems. McDonald with three now. He has produced a clinical finish there to cap off a terrific passage of play. Both sides have struggled to generate momentum so far. Grundy showing his skills. Parker, they'll compete inside the 50. Heaney takes a beauty. That was great use of the body. He's so hard to beat in those situations. Two in a row, he gets it, and he does. He's kicked beautifully at goal today. His confidence must be sore. The Swans having a good patch. Grundy wins it. How will the umpire see this? Drives it inside the forward 50. Right, that hand pass was telegraphed. Campbell, quality delivery by foot. Parker takes the logical option. McLean, the Bombers have been caught napping. Just a question of whether the lead will be six points or one. This for three on the trot, and he steers it through. Momentum's a marvellous thing in football, isn't it? The Bombers really need to respond now. Grundy palms it down. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Couldn't get a disposal. Papley, he ran into a brick wall. Good build-up. They're a big chance here. Punched away. Dersma, stripped of it. McDonald, it's a goal. 
They might want to tighten up on him. They gave him too much space on that occasion, and he made the most of it. Both sides have had their moments, and we're delicately poised as we near half time. Good ruck work. Parker comes free in the tackle. Merritt, he's wrapped up. Into the pocket he goes. Punched away. Perkins. This will be a goal. Through it goes. And there's a kick the difference. Their efficiency in front of the sticks has arguably kept them in this game. They're slugging it out, these two. It's been an entertaining first half. The big men fly. Parrish is there in the clinches. They've put themselves under pressure. Going for territory. Time for the Crummers to go to work. Grundy, that was almost handed to him. Dangerous place to lose it. This would be a timely goal. The kick's a bit wonky. You turn the ball over there, you've got to expect to pay the price. The Swans have got it out to two goals. Rucks go at it. Solid tackle. Merritt, that'll be play on. Parrish sets sail for home, and he is delivered. The pace and skill with which they're moving the footy is enabling them to hit the scoreboard regularly. So a timely goal late in the piece. Goldstein with a deft tap. Parrish has brought his own ball. Defence 101 there. Stringer, clever handball. Every bit counts, so I guess. Lloyd to bring it back in. Blakey working hard and presenting well. This might be a chance for the high flyers. Redmond takes an excellent grab. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Goldstein has it at half forward. Merritt kicking for his first. Punched away. Cunningham navigated the traffic. Lloyd, the Bombers have won it back. He's got it. The Swans are all at sea trying to defend them. They're scoring almost at will. The Bombers have the edge, but they're in a dogfight. Don't worry about that. Grundy wins the hit out. Dersma, Parrish normally delivers. Hobbs. What's he got on offer? That's a strong mark. Straightforward, you would think. He makes no mistake. Well, it's one thing to take the contested mark, but another to have the composure to finish off your good work. The Bombers with a bit of breathing space now. Punch clear. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? They'll sweep this ball forward. Goldstein. He's suddenly a popular man. That's an impressive mark. They're running on top of the ground at the moment and playing an excellent brand of footy. They like it behind the goals. He's got it. They're having a real purple patch and making it count on the scoreboard. Four in a row. We've hit the long break, and it's a handy margin, but by no means a match-winning one. This game's very much in the balance. Let's head down to Gary Lyon on the boundary. The Bombers threw everything at them in the first half and fully deserve the lead. Have they got enough left in the tank, though? They might look to play some tempo footy and conserve a little bit of energy where they can, which might further frustrate the opposition as well. Thanks for those observations, Gary, as we get back underway. The two big men do battle. Dersma, Parker. Finally, they go inside 50. Good disciplined defense. Florence, the distance is the only problem. He's got it. He's finally on the score sheet. It's been quiet today, but he made that one count. The Bombers by seven points. Grundy slaps it out. Dersma, he's run into trouble. Goldstein 
Can he find a teammate? Punched away. Lloyd. Cunningham. Searching kick. The Swans might be in a spot of bother. It's there! Typical small forwards goal there. He's a real live wire inside 450. The Bombers are keeping them at arm's length. Grundy got his palm to it. Adams, it's a hot footy. Parker, McLean is a beacon in that forward line. These half chances can often be the difference. The distance is the only problem. Laverde with a terrific mark deep in defence. The Bombers are playing some great footy. Good thinking and good execution too. Redmond, they've got time to put the kettle on. Rampy with the big fist. Hobbs, this should end in a shot at goal. Hamlin, Spoils, Mills, Lloyd, and they're out of trouble. Mackay went bang. Rowbottom, it's a tough game. Stoppage coming up on the wing. Goldstein, the winner there. Merritt, is anyone home? Perkins drops into the hole and marks. That won't make the distance. Langford! The Bombers have certainly looked a better side. They'll be hard to catch. That's smart play, really. There's no point taking unnecessary risks. Blakey heads wide with the kick in. Cunningham has found some space. Manages to find a teammate. Gives it everything. Merritt clears the area. Adams, terrific tackle. No way through there and they'll reset. Goldstein wins the tap. Parrish, this is great pressure footy. Probing ball. That's what they call a good old fashioned clanger. I've liked his game today. The Swans are out of trouble. Clever kick. Hobbs went bang. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. How's it looked down there, Gary? It's been good to see both sides hitting the scoreboard. It's an enjoyable game of footy. Grundy has rucked tirelessly. Dersma, Merritt, that's skillful. Parrish. Picking their way through. Hobbs at half forward. Useful hand pass. It's a high kick, a real rainmaker. Hamlin had the presence of mind to get to the dangerous spot. His field kicking is normally first rate. Doesn't often waste it. Parker, Cunningham. He'll be sore in the morning. Blakey, he's under close attention. Adams, recognizing the urgency. No one can mark. Merritt, in the thick of it as ever. He's kicked it high. Hobbs gets to the front spot. The Bombers playing like winners. Dersma gives the handball away. Redmond, Hobbs, Merritt lays it off. Well done. Their ball movement has been impressive. It looks a well-oiled forward line. This is going to have to be a terrific kick, but he's certainly capable. Heads for home, it's close. What does the goal umpire say? A few heads will start to drop soon if they can't turn the tide. They're right on the edge. The Swans will be hearing alarm bells right about now. It's been a great duel between the two big men. Mills, I think he called for that. They can smell victory. Stringer is so strong one-on-one. -on -one. To make it effectively a five-goal game. He's normally dependable, and he is this time. They've risen to the challenge and are playing inspired football. The Swans are on the precipice. They desperately need to ignite. Grundy punches it out of the ruck. Knew the tackle was coming. Goldstein in the centre square. 
You can see their confidence growing. McCartan wins it back. Great mark. A chance to clear now. Quality delivery by foot. Loy knew where the help was. Goulden, the Bombers guarding the corridor. Who's front and centre? Crunching tackle. They appeal for a free kick, but we'll have a stoppage. Grundy wins it. Mills. This will be their first entry for a while. Papley loves these situations. Gaz, what's caught your eye? The Bombers have made some mistakes, but they haven't been deterred. They just keep creating opportunities. Merritt gets his kick despite the heat. Stringer. They're huffing and puffing. Punched away. Loy, he's lost possession. Tries to take him on and loses. To really stamp some authority on this match. Got a little time here. How's the kick? Nothing wrong with that. Who'd want to be a defender when the ball's coming down with such regularity? The Swans are right on the ropes now. The big men fly. Dersma pounces. Adams, Mills attracted a crowd. Grundy out of the congestion. Goulden, good penetration on the kick. No one can mark. McDonald will keep coming. It's there. They've looked to the likely source to provide a spark, and he's done just that. The Swans haven't played great footy, but they're hanging in there. Goldstein palms it down. Look at him go. Rampy gets to it first. How will the umpire see this? They're going nowhere and we'll have a stoppage near the centre. Good ruck work. Merritt met solidly. Takes the responsibility. Just needs to finish. Finish he does. We've got five for the corner now and there's time for more too. It's not over yet, but it might be soon. Grundy showing his skills. Parker, Mills, he's besieged. Dersma, Hobbs, Parrish, Perkins has marked in front of goal. Well, there's one side working hard at the moment. The other side's just sitting back waiting for their teammates to do the work. Two already today. Can he make it three? You bet he can. If this league grows any bigger, we might see some heads start to drop. The Bombers look in the mood to dish out a real hiding here. Goldstein with a deft tap. Good ruck work and good roving too. Some people can't kick that far. Dersma, solid tackle, kicking for his first. Punched away. Caddy to cap it off with a goal. That's strange. They forget where he was. Blakey with the footy. Cunningham. All on his own. Brings it out wide. Adams has a vice-like grip. Kicks to space. The kick is precise. It's no place for the faint-hearted. The crowd cries, ball, and they get their wish. The Swans have denied them the corridor. Adams spoils. Parker, can he hit a target? Grundy, just waiting for the right moment to press go. Got to get rid of it. He doesn't waste many. Amati, what a mark. He struggled to make an impact to this point. Lace out, great footy. McDonald, no one's gone near him, and he could make them pay. It'll take his best, but we've seen him do it before. Hasn't got hold of that one. It'll be a behind. That's a rare miss. They've been deadly accurate today. Redmond heads wide with the kick in. Good work rate. He might have thought about the corridor. Grundy cuts it off. Heads towards the half forward flank. This ought to end in a goal. Inside 50 with the kick. Mills works hard to present. Kicking at his first. That's offline. Didn't really give it a chance. That was a promising build-up and deserved a better finish. Redmond to bring it back in. Ridley can keep it moving. 
Ignoring the corridor for now. Grundy spoils. Loy goes very wide. Goulden. The defence is disorganised. Papley has a way of drawing the footy. Well played. Would be an understatement to say they need this. In towards goal. He's made the goal umpire work. They dodged a bullet there. They might not be so lucky next time. Redman heads wide with the kick in. The Bombers have winners everywhere. It's a high ball. Spud Brawley would have loved that one. Mills, he's set upon. Great tackling technique there. The two big men do battle. Merritt. Poor hand pass there, and we've got a throw in. What are your thoughts, Gaz? The Bombers have had a decisive edge in clearances, and that's one of the reasons they find themselves well in front on the scoreboard. Merritt. Ball spills free in the tackle. Grundy under pressure. He's caught. Parrish. Cox. The Swans are chasing tail. Stringer takes the mark and can extend the margin. The Bombers with a late chance. He should have the distance, but I'm not sure he has. McCartan tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Happy to concede it behind. The Swans are under siege at the moment. What can they generate? They're moving the footy well here. That might attract a pack. Hobbs making his claim for the Golden Fist Award. Lots to analyse, Gary. What stands out? The Swans aren't doing their forwards any favours here. It might be time for the coach to switch things up. He ran into a brick wall. Parker, Haywood, thought his way through it. Amati has it within range. It's been a dark day, but that was a more positive passage of play, and it should result in a goal. Looking to pull one back, and that's exactly what he's done. Well played. The Swans are not out of this by any stretch of the imagination. Maybe there's a glimmer of hope, just a glimmer. Grundy with the tap. Parker closed him down. An ill-directed hand pass. Throws it on the boot. No one can mark. Gresham. Merritt. He's going for home. And why wouldn't he with a finish like that? The Bombers have set themselves up for what should be a stress-free final term. They've been far too good. The Swans are on the canvas. Goldstein wins it out of the centre. It's a hot footy. Merritt thumped away. Goulden. It's a tough game. Grundy. Adams. Goldstein reads the play so well. No one can mark. McCartan. The aerialist will battle for this ball. Haywood. Good hands. Rowbottom. He hasn't been himself today. McLean is a beacon in that forward line. Relatively straightforward kick, but that's easy to say from here. Struck it well, no problems there. A contested mark and goal, exactly what the doctor wanted. The Swans are just hanging in there, but they need to string some goals together. Grundy has rucked tirelessly. Rowbottom, Redman wins it back. Goldstein. Greg Williams would have been proud of that one. Three quarters done, and this has been a real turn up. I don't think anyone tipped it. It's time for some observations from Gary Lyon. The Swans. With it all to do in this last quarter, the realisation that risks must be taken often makes a team much more dangerous and less predictable. Some teams play their best footy in this type of headspace, which makes you wonder why they don't employ it from the first bounce. We'll see how it plays out. Thanks, Gary.
It's been a great duel between the two big men. He's suddenly a popular man. He's everywhere at the moment. Right, marks, and this is in danger of becoming a rout. It's not a gimme goal, but certainly one that should be kicked. Drop punt, and he has put it away. We've got no answers for him. He's too big, too strong, too good. The Bombers are strutting their stuff. They're a force to be reckoned with. Grundy wins it. Parker, crunching tackle. Papley, dangerous to leave on his own. Rowbottom, well, that's not like him. Keen to get this ball forward. Langford, they're irrepressible at the moment. Right, demanded the footy and got it. For a lead in excess of 40 points. Grundy takes a potentially goal-saving mark on the last line of defence. Good thinking and good execution too. Goulden. Not a lot of positives today. Amati. Who will stand under that? Laverde. Got a fist in. McDonald. Papley. He just dropped it. That's poor play. Merritt. No one can mark. Adams. He's wrapped up. They're still cracking in hard, deep into this match. Grundy slaps it out. Attracted a crowd. Merritt takes the hand pass. Parrish. That's a fine mark in the back pocket, and they might have dodged a bullet. He's generally a good kick. Quality delivery by foot. Parker blasts away. No one can mark. Goldstein. They've got winners all over the park. Hobbs. Parrish, boot to ball just in time. Sloppy disposal and a turnover. Adams, working hard and presenting well. Good looking kick, Amati. Looking to peg one back. Punched away, Rowbottom. They sorely need a goal and he delivers. Not much has gone right for them today, but that was a great passage of play. There's one crack papered over. The big men fly. He's stopped in his tracks. They should have been going forward. Now they'll have to defend. Right. Had his name written all over. This is what he gets paid to do. Kick these goals. That's not going to come back. It wasn't his best effort. Well, you can't afford to dwell on it. Just got to make sure you get the next one. He's off. Florence to bring it in. McAdoony working hard and being rewarded. And they're away. Parker, good handball. Merritt popped up out of nowhere. Gresham marks at centre half forward. Cox has found some space. He's been quiet. Caddy can go back and shoot at goal. A goal here will shut the door on them. Hammers at home. If you had any doubt before, you shouldn't now. The Bombers in this form would challenge anybody. Draper with a deft tap. Parrish. It's no place for the faint hearted. He just keeps racking up disposals. Great footy. They're hard to stop when they move the ball like that. They just haven't had an answer for him, nor many of his teammates, to be fair. It's on the way, and there's another nail in the coffin. The defenders are entitled to be annoyed with their mids. They're under all kinds of pressure. The Swans might need to crack open plan C in a minute. Grundy showing his skills. Hobbs, that's a bruising tackle. The Bombers finishing strongly. Punched away. Right. Going for a half dozen. He's got it! Six of the best! They've been consistently able to find avenues to go through quick and direct ball movement. Underway once more. Good ruck work. Hobbs. He'll feel that one. Merritt. Parrish. Was he held without it? Haywood. The Swans should score here. McLean has a vice-like grip. He kicked this more often than not.
Needs it to bend back, but it's not going to. He'll be itching for an opportunity to make up for that. He's off. Ridley, tasked with the kick in. Gee, they're playing well. The Bombers are red hot at the moment. Manages to find a teammate. They're a delight to watch. Cox. This deserves a goal. Hobbs marks inside 50 and can have a shot. They're still hungry, even with the game put to bed. That's a sign of a very good team. If anyone can, it's him. But he hasn't got that online. I think he was within his rights to have a crack from there, even though he'll be disappointed with the result. Away he goes. Blakey to bring it in. McAlooney with a chance to run. The Swans can build something here. Good kick. Robottom has found some space at halfback. That's come off the instep. It's a waste of a promising build-up. They're leading them a merry dance. Langford. They're playing with purpose and poise. No one can mark. And we'll have a throw in. The Bombers are really on top in the clearances at the moment. If that continues, this match is only going to go 1-1. Grundy got his palm to it. Rowbottom. Rampy in the right spot. McAdooney gets the kick away. No one can mark. Ridley. He's so clean with the footy. Parrish in the clear on centre wing. Perkins. The Swans have no answers. Honours the lead. This is getting ugly. Warner went bang. Rampy. Terrific tackle. Playing for pride now. Adams. Amati. Up and under. No one can mark. Merritt. McGrath. Out wide with the kick. The Bombers have winners everywhere. They're cutting them to ribbons. Cox. Marks on centre wing. Heads towards half forward. Thumped away. Right with an opportunity. Desperate defence. We've got a whistle, umpire's ball. Punch clear, Adams is cool under pressure. Rowbottom, he'll be sore in the morning. No one can mark. Redmond, hurry kick goes very wide. Cox. Sweeping handball, Redmond. That's a shake. Whatever he's suffering from, it's not leather poisoning. They need a mark. Punched away. Lloyd going at his first, and he's got it. The Swans have obviously had a tough day, but that was much better play. The Sting's well and truly gone out of this one. Grundy with the tack. Hobbs. Merritt, stripped of the footy. Draper puts his head over it. Who's at home? Thumped away. Langford, Rampy, threw himself at it. He's already got one. Now he's got two. That's what happens when you leave players in space inside 50. It's going to hurt you on the scoreboard. The goals are coming thick and fast. This is great to watch. Draper gets his hand to it. Dersma. Rampy, desperate to win it back. Does well under pressure. Rowbottom. McAdooney. They need to hit the scoreboard here. Redmond is there in defence. It's a dominant display. Martin. Draper. That's good vision. The Bombers continue to do as they wish. Parrish. Redmond. It's a tough game. The umpire whistles for a ball up. Grundy punches it out of the rut. Rowbottom. This is great pressure footy. He's under close attention. Papley. They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded. It was a fine tackle. Grundy, the winner there. Cox. Caddy. Can he get a kick away? Draper. Parrish. Tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. Martin 
They're playing like champions. That's a good option, and this looks promising. Parrish, for a second goal today, it'll have to wait. He's missed. A fine passage of play. Didn't get the finish it deserved. Blakey to bring it in. The kick was centimetre perfect. Can they get something going? McAnooney. No one can mark. Campbell goes laterally. That's a strong mark. It's been a disappointing performance, but he can paper over a crack or two here. Kicks for goal. It's a lovely looking kick. He's drawn it. They took the right options of moving that ball forward and were able to take the opportunity when it presented. They've got one back. Let's see if they can double up. It's been a great duel between the two big men. Bit of a nothing kick. Perkins has a paddock in front of him. Cox sets sail for home, and he is delivered. There aren't many teams who can go with them when they're playing like this. They're firing on all cylinders. Everything they've touched has turned to gold today. Grundy wins the hit out. Goulden needing support. Inside 50 with the kick. Ridley got the handball away. Laverde. The Bombers look well drilled. Adams went bang. The Swans will have no shortage of things to work on at training during the week. Grundy palms it down. Cox, he's caught. Ridley, a good kick here and they'll be in business. That's a bit of a gift. Towards the boundary line. No one can mark. And out it goes. Gaz, what have you noticed down at ground level? The Bombers are putting the opposition's defenders under all sorts of pressure. And the Fords are making it count on the scoreboard. He ran into a brick wall. Sloppy hands and they've turned it over. It wasn't the best kick, and we'll have a throw in. The Bombers have been so impressive today. This will give them huge belief. Rucks go at it. Goulden, Warner. It's there! They might want to tighten up on him. They gave him too much space on that occasion, and he made the most of it. Back in the middle. Draper wins the hit out. Dersma, Cox, solid tackle. This might be a chance for the High Flyers. Wright had his name written all over it. Fourth dream of these shots. He shouldn't have any trouble, and he doesn't. And that was reminiscent of Tony Plugger Lockett, the way he used his body. Then went back and put it straight through the middle. The Swans are having a nightmare. Draper wins the hit out. Met solidly. That's unusual. McAnooney, Goulden, Haywood heads for full forward. Amati. It's a goal. He's certainly one who can hold his head up high. He's been terrific. The Swans get themselves a late consolation prize. Draper with a deft tap. Cox, he's run into trouble. He's hit up the lead. The defence has fallen down. Caddy, that's a big play. He's been striking them well. This shouldn't present any problems. That is going very close. It's just not giving the ball back, which makes it hard for any team. The scoreboard's about to fall over, it's so lopsided. The big men fly. Dersma. The Bombers came away with a win. Too strong, too tough, and too good. That's all for today. Hope you enjoyed the action. It's bye for now.